There are so many Democrats trying to take Trump's job, it's becoming a joke, but the joke's on them. Seriously, the Democratic primary is shaping up to be one of those clown cars. Open the door and watch them all tumble out. The first poll about the 2020 race has come out. Looks like the clowns are in big trouble. Boom, looks like Americans aren't feeling the burn. Bernie may be leading the other Democrats, but according to Rasmussen, Trump is beating Sanders with 47 percent. What's even more amazing? Bernie is only getting 74 percent of his own party. Trump is actually scoring 19 percent support from Democrats. That's one in five. I mean, how bad can you be that you can't get three quarters of your own party's support? Trump is enjoying a nice fat Republican lead of 83 percent. Biden seems to have a better chance, but wait. In a matchup with Trump, Donald apparently loses 49 percent to 44 percent, but there's one big problem. Democrats have spent the last few weeks trying to sabotage Biden's chances. They were the ones who came out with all those touchy, feely accusations. Looks like Democrats are throwing overboard the only guy who might have a chance against the Donald. Dot ouch. See you later, creepy Uncle Joe. Dot with 18 and counting, Democrats running for the top spot, the money is getting spread thin. And former Starbucks CEO Schultz is running as a moderate independent, probably stealing even more votes from left-wing Democrats. Democrats in a very weak starting position, and they only have themselves to blame. Meanwhile, Trump and the GOP are rocking the fundraising with millions coming in from regular Americans. But Trump needs everyone's help, he needs them to show up and get out the vote if they really want four more years of the Trump train and not the Democrat clown car.